Honor of Kings is back at it again dito mga par. Naglabas na naman dito ng bagong karakter which is a jungler dito. And napaka lupet niya dito na karakter ladies and gentlemen. Ipapakita natin mamaya yung kanyang mga skills. And just so you know, pwede nyo dito kunin to libre July 27 and July 28. Mag-login lang ka dito sa game. Punta nyo lang dito yung events tab. And then just uh, scroll down a little bit. Makukuha mo na rin siya dito kagad. And also sa kanyang release ngayon, may additional pa siya dito na skin na kasama, which is a rare skin. So you can definitely go here and try to buy it kasi naka-discount siya ngayon. Nakatuxedo siya? Seryoso? What is up fam? Welcome back dito sa ating page. And today we'll be discussing the skills of Ogren, one of the strongest jungler na nirelease dito ni Honor of Kings. And let's go ahead and talk about his skills first as well as yung passive. Kasi it's actually very interesting to say the least. So the first one dito that we need to talk about is yung kanyang first skill. So ang first skill niya dito guys, um, this is very easy dito to understand. Um, it just creates another pathway basically. That once you traverse, um, you can ignore dito terrains and your uh, movement speed will also increase us. And at the same time, as you can see, my second phase yun siya, pwede mo siya dito pindutin ulit. Uh, let's do it again. So, as you can see, oh, may parang cooldown siya. So, once you pindut yan ulit, makikita mo yan, oh, kukunin niya dito yung kanyang weapon. And then, there's a cooldown din dito sa taas, which is basically 4 seconds lang. And that is the seer state. So what do I mean by seer state? So, ang kagandaan kasi dito ng skill dito ni Ogran, whenever your seer state is activated, there's the ability dito to just execute every single character, even dito mga minions, after 10%. So, if ever 10% below yung kanilang HP ang natira, automatic execute yan. So, ang first skill niya dito mga pag seer state ka, and this is only for 4 seconds. Yung kanyang second skill naman guys, um, this is like just a uh, knockback a little bit. So, as you can see there, na-knockback siya dito pag natamaan siya dito sa second part. And then, let's do it again. Okay. So, as you can see guys, there are two areas dito sa kanyang uh, first skill, ah, uh, second skill, sorry. So, eto, pag natamaan ka dito sa gitna, sa ila, sa, sa second part, uh, mananakbak sila. But, kung natamaan ka dito sa outer side, nung indicator, um, hindi sila dito mananakbak. As you can see. And then, yung may natira dyan na parang something na gumanon, um, that's basically, if ever na mapunta sila dun, masuslow dito yung um, mga kalaban. So, additional point dito pagdating sa kanyang second skill, if ever mataman tatlo dito, mag-activate dito yung enhanced basic attack mo which is madami sila dito matatamaan up to 3 enemies. And at the same time, kung sino nyo dito yung may stack, you will heal dito additional. So, pakita ko sa inyo ha. So, tamaan natin siya dito ng second skill. Yeah, okay. As you can see, there you go. So, nag heal ka dito. Alright, so when it comes to sa kanyang third skill, ladies and gentlemen, it's actually very, very easy lang. You will also enter dito sa seer state, which is actually, I believe, 10 seconds. Oh, yeah, sorry, 8 seconds lang pala. So, first skill, tsaka yung kanyang third skill, yun yung pwede dito mag-execute. Explain ulit. Seer state dito is yung 10% na um, HP dito and below. May execute ka kagad. Automatic dito ni tatas ka, tapos ibabalibag ka. And at the same time, kung sino yung matatamaan, pre, uh, mananakbak din sila for 0.5 second. And as well as yung kanilang spirit dito, tatamaan sila dito, mag-basic attack dito sa kanila. So, I'll try to um, pakita sa inyo mamaya. There you go. As you can see, oh, nakita nyo yung sa gilid na parang shadow sa Gedli. Sa gilid lang nito. Oh. Okay, let's do it again. Okay, there you go. So both of them dito, may mga shadow sila. Yun yung parang spirit kumbaga. And at the same time, umaatake din dito for 8 seconds din. So not only that you will also enter your seer state, but also there are other spirits dito that you can also summon. Um, para magiging mas malakas itong damage mo overall. We have an additional dito na passive din na pwede natin pag-usapan. Which is yung kanyang magical dito na sabog sa kanyang basic attack. So, after ka dito mag-link, after ka dito mag-normal attack, as you can see, may bar dyan sa ilalim. 
Pag natapos yan guys, sasabog yan dito which is a magical damage. As you can see, sumasabog siya dito. Ayan, every time dito na nawawala yan, sasabog yan. So yan yung kanyang additional dito nito ng passive. So this character has a physical damage, a magical damage at the same time a pure damage dito coming from the execute yung kanyang additional pa dito na passive. What is up fam? So let's talk about yung pinaka basic dito na combo that you can do with Ogren. So just like what I've said earlier, may madami siya ditong passive. We can put that into use right now and let's do the most basic combo na pwede natin ditong gawin. So, um, if ever ang kalaban nasa gitna, so you can do this. Puntaan mo yung likod. So, first skill ka, movement speed boosted. Second skill, ult. There you go. And then, normal attack, normal attack ka na lang. Okay, so once you enter dito yung uh, seer state, you can execute dito yung mga kalaban normally just like that one. There you go. And that's it.